All right, guys, so we have some NFL Combine players revealed tonight for the promo tomorrow. Starting off right away, guys, we have comment of the day coming in from right here. I'm also running a giveaway for some mutt cards for Xbox One and PS4. I icon in the right-hand corner will take you to that video. Also, guys, question of the day. Make sure you go down below in the comment section and tell me your answer for this question. Which player set the broad jump record in 2015 with 12 feet 3-inch jump? Tell me down below in the comments. Also, make sure to hit the like and subscribe button. Let's get right into it. So, guys, today we have right here our first player is going to be Javion Clowney, which once he gets his power up, his power up is going to be insane. His power up is going to have 90 speed, already have secure tackler, which is the best in the game. He already has, uh, what's called, uh, plus two to block shed with physical front. So, this card is going to be even more insane. Once he gets powered up. But he's already insane right here as you can see. Next card we have here is going to be Mr. Taron Armstead. Now as you can see right here he has 90 uh, run block, 97 pass block, 96 impact block with 89 strength. Now according to multiple uh, sources strength doesn't matter so... I guess the 89 strength doesn't really matter. He does have, um, I forget what chemistry this is. I believe it's the lead block, if I am correct. He also has go deep times two. Next card we have here is going to be Odell Beckham, 96 overall. 95 speed, 94 catching, 94 looseness, 97 spec catch, 90 release, 94 route running, 90 catching traffic, and 95 jumping. Very, very nice card, as you can see right there. He also has Energizer, which, my personal opinion, I hate Energizer unless it's on kickoffs. Kickoffs and punt returners, Energizer is the best chemistry in the game. But for wide receivers, I'd rather have Playmaker. Next card we have here is going to be Patrick Peterson coming in with 94 speed, 94 acceleration, 97 agility, 96 man, 91 zone, 94 press, 90 play record, 84 catching. He also has Return Man and Toughness times 2, which, eh, full corner. I could do without. We also have Ryan Chazier coming at 93 speed, 91 awareness, 94 tackle, 91 play rock, 91 block shed, 96 pursuit, 88 zone, 94 hit power, and we have hot hands, and finally read and react times too. Now guys, we have the master, the man, the master that has been the master for the last eight years of mutt in this combine promo. I am exaggerating. We have CJ2K. With 97 speed. Did, could he not have 99 speed EA? Come on. I mean, I mean, come on. No 99 speed. <sighs> Rather disappointing. No 99 speed for CJ2K, sadly, but he does have 97 speed, 96 agility, 97 acceleration, 94 carrying, 95 spin move, 97 elusiveness, 85 chalking, and 97 juke move. Uh, as you can see right here, very, very nice card. Probably one of the best halfbacks in the game now, if not the best. And of course, with that in mind, that's going to wrap up the players we have revealed for today, for tomorrow's promo. Now, guys. Key tip when it comes to this, this is just the Masters, right? These are just the highest overall players for this promo. That doesn't mean we're probably going to get a lot of 97 plus, oh, not 97, sorry, 90 to 94 plus overall players with this promo too. So expect to get even more players with this. I'm expecting a John Ross card. I'm expecting a Vernon Davis. I'm expecting, you know, um... All the players from the last year's combine to be in this game tomorrow. So again, a lot of those players don't have high overall cards, so they can't get high overall cards. Now, certain players like Marshawn Lattimore and um, Alvin Kamara already have 97, so they can't get cards. But any player that was in last year's uh, combine should get cards this year. Again, we have to wait and see who they end up being. But I will make a video at 10.30 a.m. tomorrow covering all this, guys. Covering all the players that end up being in the game. Again, we should get new solo challenges. If they do it based on last year, I'm hoping they don't. But last year, how the solos worked was we had combined solos. Where you had to have each single combined ability or chemistry in order to unlock each solo sequence. I'm hoping they don't do that this year. I'm hoping it just is, you know, the copy and paste solos they love to do. And we get a free combine player. Now, what we did learn, though, 
from the um, GameStop ad, and I made a video on it, was that you can go ahead and choose your own Combine Champion. Now, if we go ahead and look at this, it doesn't say Combine Champion on, on anywhere on this card. So I'm not sure if you can choose from one of these players. Most likely not. I would probably guess... Uh, unless they have a whole nother part of this promo where they're all combine champions. But if it's not, then I guess you would be able to choose from these players. If you do get to choose from these players and you get one for free based on, you know, how the combine champion works, that would be really dope. But I'm going to take a guess that it's going to be other cards you get to choose from. Uh, again, if you did not see the video, pretty much GameStop ad said you get to choose one uh, gauntlet champion to build from you know nothing to greatness so pretty much just like the snow beast if you guys were around for the snow beast promo you could build a card from 80 overall to a 93 the same concept applies with the combine promo so you get to build a card from maybe an 80 again to a 96 possibly with these nfl combine players or maybe it's going to be some other players you get to build up who ends up will end up finding out tomorrow i'm not sure if you're going to do uh, be through throw challenges, through sets again, probably something like that. But I'm hoping we also get some good objectives. We'll all find out tomorrow, and I'm really excited about this. These players look very, very dope, and all these players, I believe, have power-up sets. So all these players are going to get power-up cards, so we're going to have literally so many 97 overalls. We should get power-up cards tomorrow with this promo releasing, because EA knew about these players for about a week now. Well, probably a week and a half now so they probably have the power-ups all ready to go with this promo but definitely guys give me your thoughts and opinions down below do you like this promo do you hate this promo if you could choose one card out of this promo you could get for free which player would you choose and also if you had to choose one player you want in this promo 100 guaranteed which player would that be my personal opinion i want to see a john moss i want to see him have 97 plus speed I don't know if he's going to because CJ2K couldn't even get 99 speed. He only got 97 speed. So I'm not sure if they're going to be able, they're going to give, you know, John Ross a 99 speed. I know they're trying to hold back with speed because that's the one thing that could break Madden completely is giving, you know, a card 99 speed. But I'm hoping John Ross gets at least one card because he is the fastest player in the NFL. He needs a fast card in this game. I know Tyreek Hill. I wouldn't be surprised if Tyreek Hill got a card or some other players are really fast. But I know, you know, Tyreek Hill has many cards. John Ross needs a 97 speed card. Or 98, maybe, maybe 99. I know EA is not going to do that. But thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to like and subscribe button. See you guys in the next one. Peace out.